Okay, the jack-o'-lantern spectacular presented by Thornton's is back. I'm so excited to be here. With me right now is Brooke Pardue. This is like so exciting. Last time I talked to you about this, I was at home in a makeshift kind of studio and now we're back. We are back and we are walking on the trail again this year and it just is so exciting to have some sort of return to normalcy when it comes to the show. I love it and I love it right now. We're kind of like in the birthplace of all of the jack-o'-lanterns and now Travis, you are an artist. Like how much work does this take and how many artists? Oh man, well, there's about 20, 25 artists. Uh, you know, some are here 15, 16 hours a day, and some are here only a day or two a week. But when it's warm and rainy like this, you know, typically a pumpkin will last about a week to 10 days. But when it's like this, we're already replacing after four days. So, yeah, I think dr cool, dry air. That is crazy. Okay, so do you kind of redo some of the pumpkins, or are you doing, like, different stuff? Uh, well, the theme remains the same but the images will often change. Yeah, we, we leave it up to the artist. If they'd like to replace something with the same thing they can, or if they want to do something different, they, they have the free will to do that as well. So really you could come back multiple times and you might see something oh, yeah. a little bit differently. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah, I love that. Okay, now Brooke, where can we get tickets? What do we need to know beforehand? jackolanternlouisville.org is the website. Uh, we have gone to time ticketing every night of the show this week, so we encourage people to go ahead and purchase their tickets so the date and the time is still available that they would like to come. Um, and just thank everybody for coming out. Proceeds benefit the Parks Alliance of Louisville and our public parks. That is fantastic. Okay, coming up, we're going to have more from the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular.